Hi guys, welcome to today's video. Today, Roxy and I are announcing a uh, partner swap that we are going to be co-hosting. Um, this is called the Hugs and Kisses Swap. This is the hashtag right here, hashtag XOXO Swap. I'm super excited about this swap, you guys, because it's a partner swap. So it's not a group swap. You are only going to be making one swap for your partner and you will receive one swap, which I think is going to be really fun and different because all of this year I've been hosting group swaps. So I'm excited to do a partner swap. Um, so uh, Roxy and I came up with a few things that we want to um have as requirements for the swap. Um, but let's start with some of the information. So basically it's US only. Um, you must be an experienced crafter and you must have swapped, of course, in the past. Um, you must have current craft accounts. So like Instagram or YouTube must be active. Um, you know, par participating in a partner swap is a really great way to get to know more crafters and make new friends. So um, the success of the swap really depends on good communication between partners and um, and making or meeting the deadline. Um, of course, you know, meeting the deadline is going to alleviate stress from everyone involved. So um, uh, unlike our group swaps, you know, if someone fails to follow through in a group swap, it really doesn't affect the group because you can just move people around and, um, you know, everybody that participates receives a, a swap. In a partner swap, if someone drops out, then of course there's going to be someone who's going to be left out and disappointed and it just creates stress on the whole group. Um, so for we're wanting you to really be 100% fully committed to the swap if you decide to sign up. Um, again, it's going to be a partner swap. So we really want, um, you know, our partners, uh, we want all of the participants to receive a swap and to be happy with that swap. So for that reason, we're asking for experienced crafters. You must have not dropped out of a previous swap or been late for a previous swap. Um, so that is all of the information. Now let's get to the fun stuff, which are the requirements for the swap. So the due date for the swap is gonna be February 4th or postmark date, February 4th. Um, you must use a Valentine's paper collection. So I know in the past I've joined swaps where it's not required to use a Valentine's paper collection as long as you make the swap look um, like it's Valentine's themed. For this swap in particular, we absolutely want you to use a Valentine's paper collection. It can be an old one, it can be a new one, but it does need to be Valentine's paper. Um, I'm super excited to get a new collection because I've never really had a full Valentine collection. I don't have a Valentine stash at all. Um, so I'm really excited to um, get a new collection. I think I want to pick up the new Simple Stories um, collection. I don't even know what the name of it is, but I just recently saw it. Um, Roxy was sharing some collections with me and I really liked that Simple Stories one. So um, the theme of this swap is sweet treats. So candy, cookies, cakes, you know, chocolate covered strawberries, um, chocolates in a heart box, real Valentine's theme stuff, right? Um, and these are the requirements, you guys. It's We're going to swap a loaded mailbox. Um, it, you should have a Valentine's Day card, a memory decks card, one shaker, five die cuts. Make sure those are um, Valentine's themed and not like printed ephemera make sure it's die cuts um, and you only need five and then um, one crafter's choice item so it can be something like bows tags dangles rosettes those kinds of things because it's a partner swap you will not uh, be required to send anything to the hostess. You are only going to be swapping with your partner, right? Um, so we do ask that you send a gift that is um, somewhere between ten and twenty dollars. Um, you really want to spoil your partner and really make them feel special for Valentine's. So um, you know, a gift in this price range would be really great. 
Um, of course, everything in cute packaging, it just makes it all the more special. Um, a great packaging is part of the swap, right? And when you put time and effort into the packaging, you know that what is inside is even better. So, um, of course, packaging is part of the swap. Signups will be on December 14th on my Instagram account. Um, it's going to be at 6 p.m. Central Standard Time on my Instagram uh, account. I'll post, I'll make a post, and then you'll um, comment in uh, the comments. You'll say, like, sign me up or whatever, and that will go from there. Um, so we're super excited about this. Roxy and I are participating as well. Um, and we cannot wait to see what you guys come up with, what you create, what your mailboxes look like. Um, you know, once again, it's going to be a partner swap. We're going to be partnering you up right away. Um, so right away, we expect for you to be in communication with your partner. You guys decide what your swaps are going to look like. Um, you know, there isn't a particular mailbox that you need to use or, um, you know, a mailbox can be a million different things to each one of us, right? So um, as long as you and your partner are communicating and uh, have an agreement on what you are going to swap, Roxy and I will be fine with that. So we really want to keep it stress-free, fun. Um, I know it's, you know, we're in the middle of the holidays, um, but we did want to announce it now to give you time to get prepared, plan what you're going to create for your partner. Um, and yeah, just keep it as fun and stress-free as possible. So reach out to us if you have any questions. Um, you can direct message us on Instagram and, um, you know, ask all your questions before December 14th so that when you sign up, you are, uh, have every all the answers that you need. Um, and yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you soon. Bye for now.